Um, I'd just like to start, as I mentioned, to Coach Calipari at the, uh, before the game. You know, just uh, appreciative of the opportunity to play. This is a, a storied program and a good basketball team defending national champions. Uh, the challenge going in for our guys tonight was to try to find a way to win. Uh, we felt like we had a game plan. It wasn't to, to stay to stay close. We wanted to get out in transition, be aggressive. We wanted to try to out-rebound them. We wanted to get to the offensive glass. Uh, we wanted to improve as a basketball team. Uh, for us, uh, as a team, uh, ironically, our, our, I think our basketball issues are no different than what uh, Coach Kalpari has been talking about, about you know playing together, playing hard, playing competitively for 40 minutes. Uh, and that's what we tried to do. So I appreciate the opportunity. I feel like our players got better in this tough week against Washington State, UNLV at home and here. Uh, and and we're, we're, we're in the same spot as a lot of teams at this point trying to get better. Uh, and I felt today we did. We rebounded some well, um, had some breakdowns. Turnovers again became an issue for us. Uh, but ironically, we got the same number of field goals as they did. Um, shot the same number of shots. So turnovers and rebounds kept us equal in possessions. But some of our shots didn't get to the rim and where most of theirs did. So that makes it problematic. Um, but uh, we, we saw us being able to execute against their very good defense and length and, and running good offense. Um, and their, their, our turnovers led to their high percent of stuff in transition. So um, it was, it was uh, it was, a, it was a good step for us, and, and but we, we've come here with different intentions, and I appreciate it. Appreciate how our, our guys battled. So, any questions? How consistently did you think Kentucky's uh, defensive effort was uh, first half, second half? Yeah, you know, with the, Kentucky, Kentucky's defensive effort, the question was about, and, and, and I didn't. You know, um, it, it looked pretty good to me. You know, it's, it's sort of, I was focused on our guys and, um, and everything. I think, um, uh, you know, we, we, I wanted to, I don't feel like we did a good job of putting pressure on them all the time to exploit some mistakes that freshman players will, that will make. You know, whether it's a certain action you're running or uh, a certain matchup you recognize where you have an advantage of putting players in good position, I, I'm not sure that we did a good job. And that's on the coaches, not our players, in terms of executing offense to make make a freshman have to handle a good action. You know, make a freshman have to, to, to execute some things. And you know, we, we had a little bit of too much one-on-one -on -one guys having to make a play um, and, and break. And so I don't think that was the best way for us to to put pressure on Kentucky's defense. From what you saw from Kentucky in preparing for this game, how were they compared to that? Were better or have you seen improvement or what did you know? You know, it's not really my play. I don't know. I mean, I appreciate you asking my opinion. I, I, uh, in my humble opinion, I feel like uh, they, they, they competed and were focused and were really, it looks like a group of young guys trying to do the right thing, trying to compete, trying to do what their coach is asking of them, trying to make the smart play, rotating on defense, um, uh, you know, and, and, and like all the teams in November, like my team, I know my team in November, I know my team's gonna be better in two months. And I know if, under this coaching staff and the, the emphasis they're putting on this team's gonna be better. So I always tell, I always say when speaking of my team that to people that are asking that it really depends more about whether it's really a matter of the observer's perspective. The glass is either half full or half empty. So it says more about the critic than it does the, the team. Um, there's a lot in the water in that glass at the University of Kentucky. You know, so, uh, and so I, I, you know, so from my perspective, their glass is, is, is flowing over, so they'll be fine. You know, they're, they're working through some early season issues like everybody. Coach, you played Kentucky right here in the front. You played Kentucky three years in a row. There's been a lot of talk of them being similar to two years ago uh, when you played that game in the Rose Garden. Can you draw any comparisons to maybe where they are in their development at this point? It's about the roughly the same time you played them that year. Yeah, compared to two years ago, I, um, thinking back, you know, again, I appreciate the opportunity to have this experience of playing the three years running. And I would say um, they, they, see, they seem a little more similar to that team. I think that's a fair comparison in terms of not hitting on all cylinders, you know. And then, again, don't, don't quote me. Let's highlight that only quote. Coach says not hitting on all cylinders. <laughs> so I'm very careful. And they are very good. And they're, I, they look like they're hitting on all cylinders to me. I mean, um, so, 
but but they you know but they're but I say you know they're just uh, the veterans they lost last year you know the veterans they lost they look a little younger and a little more you know and so I, I just think uh, there are some similarities you know I I just wanted I wish we had put some more pressure on them to to see. Right. How would you describe uh, just the challenge around the basket in terms of getting off a shot, getting off a good shot with the yeah. shot? Yeah, they're so long, they're athletic, it's no secret. Um, we knew that coming in, I think, a couple of our shots, another pump fake, you know, the, the problem is you pump fake them once, you know, there's, another one, there's another one coming on the weak side. So yeah, that's, I don't think we'll see another team with that much length and athleticism again. So it was a good test for us. and. Definitely show us where we're at with that.